U.S. House of Horrors mum Louise Turpin was allegedly regularly sold to a rich pedophile by her own mother in exchange for money, it has been claimed. Louise, 49, and her husband David, 56, made international headlines in January when U.S. authorities discovered they had held their 13 children captive within the family's Paris home in Southern California. The couple were arrested after their 17-year-old daughter phoned police, claiming she had escaped from the house where she and her siblings were being held captive. Police have alleged the siblings, aged 2 to 29, were chained to beds in the four-bedroom house. They have been charged with 12 counts of torture, 7 counts of abuse, 6 counts of child abuse and 12 counts of false imprisonment. The couple have pleaded not guilty to all charges. As they now await trial, and their children continue to embrace life away from their alleged tormentors. Louise's sister, Teresa Robinette, has sensationally claimed she and her sister were victims of ongoing sexual abuse as children. In an interview with The Sun, Ms. Robinette claims Phyllis Robinette, the sister's late mother, was the mastermind of their abuse. Our mum should have been protecting us, but she sold us to a wealthy pedophile, she told The Sun. Teresa Robinette NBC. He would slip money into my hand as he molested me. I can still feel his breath on my neck as he whispered be quiet. Ms. Robinette, 37, claims she begged her not to take them to the man, who she did not identify, but that her mother would simply reply, I have to clothe and feed you. Ms. Robinette also claimed her sister Louise took the brunt of the abuse. He destroyed my self-worth as a child and I know he destroyed hers too, she reportedly said. Meanwhile, US authorities have laid new charges against David Turpin. Charges against David Turpin were upgraded to include perjury. The Riverside County District Attorney's Office have alleged he filed paperwork incorrectly claiming his children were enrolled in full-time education at a private day school between 2010 and 2017. The father of 13 did not enter a plea relating to the new charges. They are due back in court on May 18. Copyright 9 Digital Proprietary Limited 2018.